protect the beach. Go to here. We'll go down to that trash can. But we'll do that over the course of uh, a couple of days. I've already spent in the first video about 40 minutes up this way. So let's do this. Let's people fish, walk their dogs, and enjoy the beach. Okay, I've got a real good signal here. Reading 81, I got the headphones on so I know you can't hear it. But it's, I'm hearing the double beep, so it's right there on the surface. So. Let's see. pinpoint it. It was right on the surface. There it is. A dime. The quarter, it's the best thing I've found so far. I've dug so many bottle caps. Fifty three. Four inches. Four inches in the ground. I live dig this. I don't care if it is another bottle cap. It's a different signal. Got it on vibrate because there's uh, people on the beach. Forgot about Mr. Pull Tab. Oh well. Eighty five, but with the uh, iron little grunt to it or whatever. But uh, actually, I saw it on the surface with that one metal detector. But seriously, right there's the trash can. Throw it away. Chasing a good signal here, I think. Uh, Pinpointer. This is four inches down. Got 86, 88. I'll uh, show you when I get it out. Well, it was a quarter, water and clay quarter, but uh, 
better than a beer top, but it sounded real good. It's early morning, it's just uh, daylight enough to video. But, uh, Doing a good 85, 86, 87 signal. So, I'm gonna dig this and uh, I'll show you what I find. And there it is. I think it's a quarter. Guess I should dig this. Another quarter. Two quarters for today. Not bad. I know it's close to the surface. It sounds like there's more than one there. Whatever it is. But it's diggable. Dime and a quarter. We'll see. deeper than what I thought. goodness piece of copper big old piece of copper what it was. Oh well. That's why you dig. A 
faint Narnie signal that just shows up on the VDI every once in a while. Points to eight inches. So I'll start to dig it. It was about six inches deep, but it's out of the hole. There's my foot in the hole. another quarter I'm gonna clean it off here I'm wanting to go eat breakfast and have a cup of coffee but my metal detector won't let me four inches down 90 88 Gotta dig that. I'll let you know. So here are the finds from uh, my beach hunt. Uh, doesn't look like much, but uh, talk about that in a second. Uh, for these things here are uh, iron. Uh, hold down the tent things or whatever on the beach I don't know how good that that works on the beach but uh, obviously it doesn't work well because it's, I found it uh, I found this uh, some people consider these hot rocks uh, I really think it's just a piece of scale of iron is what it turned out to be you saw me dig this some kind of uh, copper tubing with the uh, end crimped don't know what that is this represents uh, all of the uh, bottle caps that I uh, dug up. Uh, the first video you saw, I did 12. That was about 40 minutes. Uh, second day, I did about 40. And then the last day, I did about, uh, I'd say between 15 and 20 more. And I finally decided that... Uh, if I was going to find anything, I needed to uh, quit digging those. In the first video, I talked about how great these things sounded. Yeah, they rang up high, but you could definitely tell what they were. Uh, the shape of them gives a unique sound. And, and uh, so every time I heard that, I cringed. But anyway, I cleaned up uh, my part of the beach the best I could for as long as I could. But uh, for the other things, I found one, two, three, four, five quarters, a dime, a nickel, and one, two, three, four pennies. Now, these are pretty crusty, uh, pretty worn out. This one, not so much. Probably wasn't there long. But uh, I'd definitely do it again. Uh, it was fun. I did all of, that I did was in uh, dry sand. I didn't get to uh, get out in the water or get in the wet sand just because high tide was there every morning when I detected. So uh, I may go back in March and uh, may do some in the wet sand and uh, in the water a little bit. See what uh, happens. But I had a good time. Enjoyed it. And uh, hope you enjoyed the video too. Thanks for coming along with me.